Hello YouTube, it's me the Spiritman. Today I'm back with another video. In this video, we will be playing Hack the Box City of Name as Horizontal. It falls under easy category. Let me get its IP address and do some port scanning. For now, I am using Rust Scan, which is quicker than Nmap. As you can see, two ports are already found. So let me check port 80, which is for HTTP by default. For that, we have to add IP address of the machine in our slash etc slash host file. Once done, let's visit it in our browser. It does not have anything useful for us. Our scan is completed and there are all together two ports open. Now let me do some directory brute force, for that I am using GoBuster. And also let me do some subdomain finding using GoBuster. As you can see, we have found some directory, but after visiting the directory, it gives message saying forbidden. Now let's wait until our subdomain brute forcing is completed. After a while, we get a new subdomain of prefix API dash prod. Now let's add it to slash etc slash host file and visit the page in our browser. It does not have anything useful for us, so let's do some directory brute force using GoBuster. After a while, we can see that three directory have been found. So let's save them and visit slash admin aid first. After visiting slash admin page, we can see that Stravi CMS is used in this web page, which opens a login form. Let's search for Stravi admin exploit. As you can see, exploit DV has exploit available, so let's check it. The script is written in Python 3. Firstly, the script checks the version of the Stripe. Secondly, it reset admin password and provide us JWT token. And at last, it helps us to run an arbitrary code to get a reverse shell. Now use netcat to listen in port number 9999. Now search online reverse shell. You can get many links. From them, open any one and use the code I used to get a reverse shell. And make changes to the IP address and the port number as your needs. As you can see that I have got a reverse shell. Now let's stable our shell. Once our shell is in stable form, let's upload linpeas.ss file from our machine and do some enumeration.
after uploading lean page move it to slash dev slash shm folder and make it executable now run it and tee the result in case we need it for future case We can see there are three ports open for localhost. Among them, port 8000 is unusual. Also, we can see that there are three users. They are Strapi, Developer, and Root. Now use crawl command to see what is running in port 8000. We can see that it is running Laravel service. Now let's use SSH to do port forwarding. For that, create .ssh folder and assign 700 permission on it. Inside it, create an empty file named as authorized underscore keys and assign it 600 file permission. Then cat id underscore rsa dot public file on our local machine and copy it and paste it inside the authorized underscore keys file. In case you do not have id underscore rsa dot public file in your local machine, you can create it using ssh dash egen command in your local machine. Once done, let's use ssh to do port forwarding. Here we are forwarding port 8000 from our target machine to local machine in port 8000. Now let's visit localhost colon 8000 in our browser and we can confirm that it is running Laravel V8 PSP framework. Let's search for Laravel V8 PSP exploit in our browser. As you can see that it has its own CVE. So let's search for that CVE in GitHub. Now let's clone that repo inside our local machine and follow the instruction. As you can see that our arbitrary code is responding and we have a root user access. Now we can use it to get our flag. At first, let's get our user.txt flag which is present inside the slash home slash developer directory. Like that we get our first flag. Now let's get our final flag as it is present in slash root directory. And we get our all flag. Hence the challenge is completed. Thank you guys for watching this video, hope you all have learned something new from this video. Do not forget to like the video and subscribe my channel to see more content like this. Thank you all.